A US aircraft carrier arrived in South Korea on Friday for the first time in four years. It will join South Korean ships in a military show of force, which officials say aims to send North Korea a message. USS Ronald Reagan and ships from its accompanying strike force docked at a naval base in the southern port city of Busan. U.S. Strike Group Commander Rear Admiral Michael Donnelly said the U.S. is standing firmly by South Korea. So uh, we leave the messaging to the diplomats. Uh, our interactions with Iraq Navy are tactically pers uh, purposeful in developing uh, interoperability to ensure credible combat power. And uh, opportunity for us to practice our tactics and operations and to demonstrate that uh, we stand together. Its arrival is the biggest development yet, under a new push to have more U.S. nuclear-capable strategic assets up and running in the area to deter the North. South Korean President Yoon suk yeol wants more joint military exercises as a warning to Kim Jong-un, after North Korea conducted a record number of missile tests this year. Analysts believe Pyongyang appears to be getting ready to resume nuclear testing for the first time since 2017 after previous talks failed to persuade North Korea to end its nuclear program. In the past, North Korea has denounced previous joint drills as rehearsals for war and proof of hostility from Washington and Seoul.